Hi, this is Zidane Tutorials and uh, in this video, I'm going to show you how we can create duplicates of our um, any object of ours in Illustrator but at equal intervals or evenly distributed. Uh, and I'm not talking about creating blends here because uh, creating blend or using blend tool is a totally different topic and it has a lot of scope. I am talking about just basic copy paste or creating duplicates of our objects but at equal intervals. So I have uh, showcased some samples here and we uh, may need this sort of things in while creating some uh, bullet points or maybe for the sake of some designing. So now what normally happens is that let me pick a different color for this tutorial okay let's go with this one so how how we do this thing normally is that we draw something this is our object and then we copy using control C or command C and then we do control V and our object will get copied at some random location within the artboard so but what if I need it to be somewhere specific, not randomly or maybe in the center of the artboard. So this is how it works in case of normal copy paste, command C, command V or control C, control V for Windows. So what I'm going to show you is a different um, way of doing this, especially when you need it to be at some specific interval. So. Uh, maybe you're already familiar with this thing of creating a copy while holding uh, alt key uh, so you will select the object and once you will press the alt key and you will keep pressing it your cursor will change like this it will be like two uh, arrows one black and one white and then you will double click and drag out a copy so this is another way of creating a copy or duplicate of your object now it has the same problem again if i will do control uh, v uh, my copy will appear in some random uh, place within the artboard or in the center of the artboard what i need to do is i need to select my object or shape and then i will again hold the alt key and this time i will double click and put it let's say here now once I have created a copy using this method then instead of doing control C control V I'm going to do control D D for duplicate or command D so what it will do is let me show you if I will keep pressing control D my next copy will appear uh, at uh, next to the previous one but it will have the same interval uh, like the previous one so if I will keep pressing Control D, Control D, Control D or Command D for Mac users you will notice that all the upcoming duplicates are appearing at um, are appearing evenly distributed and they are they all have same intervals between them so that's the method uh, if that was all you needed to know however uh, if uh, some other cases for example and maybe if you have some other copies already let's say this one and this one here this one here and if you want some objects which are already there in your uh, artboard and you want these to be evenly distributed then you can use uh, these alignment tools but uh, I will recommend using these tools from here the align and you can access it from window align okay now if you will use this panel it will allow you to align to setting uh, allow access and instead of align to artboard you need to pick align to selection and once you pick align to selection then all these settings will apply within this box not to the entire artboard let me show you how what i mean by align to artboard and align to selection if i pick align to artboard and then i ask this panel to distribute it horizontally it will distribute it but the distribution is uh, 
based on the size of artboard so let me reverse this step and this time I will pick a line to selection and once I will pick a line to selection then I will distribute it horizontally and you see now the distribution is within the box now they have uh, this um, irregular placement so to fix that I will I can use this vertical align center and they will get aligned like this okay so you can uh, if you are creating new duplicates you can use this method of control D or command D and if you already have some objects in your artboard then you can use the align method to distribute them evenly uh, within your uh, selection or if you, even if you want uh, those to be distributed in the entire uh, artboard you can use align to artboard or align to selection so uh, let me show you uh, quickly show you how I have done all this so if I pick this star I put it here and similarly I will press hold alt key make a duplicate like this once a duplicate is created using this method then I will keep pressing Control D, Control D, Control D. So pretty simple. Similarly, uh, for this example, I will create a rectangle like this, and I will hold the Alt key, make a duplicate. Also, if you want your duplicate to be uh, aligned vertically or horizontally, you can also hold the Shift key. It will keep it straight. So once a uh, duplicate is created, then I will simply do Control D, Control D, Control D instead of using Control C and Control V. So, uh, and I did the same for this one. If, uh, okay, let me do this again. So I will I have created a copy, and let's say I put it here, and then I will pre uh, keep pressing Control D, Control D, Control D. And this way it will create duplicate uh, with uh, equal intervals or with even distribution so that's it for this video I hope it was helpful to you um, in your alignment and designing projects thank you